pretty Chris and Larry family. So we still have a lot to do in the garden. We're getting this prepped this next week. Um, but I wanted to show you, we came out to the garden and I started pulling out this bed. And this is a bed that has rhubarb that came back as well as our strawberry plants. Let's see if I can even get close enough to show you. There's a little strawberry plant coming up and the big rhubarbs are coming back. So spring is officially here. So we've got to plant some of your tomatoes today. Are you ready? We're not planting them outside, we're planting them inside. We've got heat pads to put them on. Are you ready? Uh, let's go do it. Thank you. What are you doing? I'm filling all these with this. All of what? These uh, like cups, planters, and there's leaves. Yeah, you're filling everything up with po some potting soil? Yep. And what are you going to do? Yeah, we are going to plant our loofah. We need to get that going, don't we? Yeah. Where'd you go? You disappeared. There you are. Hey, so what do you use loofah for? We use loofah for our soaps, mm -hmm. our round soaps, and that way you can get your lunch from it. So you don't have to use the scrubbing. Yep, you're right. You're doing a good job. on our baby chicks. Now we bought, um, there was 26 that came via mail and eight that we picked up at one of the feed stores for my mom. And believe it or not, everyone has lived, everyone is healthy, um, but we did have to move them between two guinea pig cages. So originally we had them all in one, but they're starting to get big enough. Yeah, uh huh. Um, and so now we've got two separate cages in here. The house is nice and warm right now, um, so they're staying pretty good. Um, we'll have one light between the two pens just to keep it warmed up in here. Uh, but let me show you. <laughs> so they're looking really good. It's, it's dinner time for them and they get some fresh water here in a few minutes because they're really messy. But they did get some of our fodder. That video is going to be in a couple days. Like I said, they're doing really, really well. So you see the fodder in there. But they are very healthy. They're looking good. <laughs> oh, and then we've got three, well, four different breeds because there was a mystery bird in here. But so we've got Delawares, uh, Columbia Wine Dots, and the Cream Lake Bars. And then the mystery bird at first kind of looked like a... Um, a uh, barred rock, but now her coloring is a little different. So I'm gonna do some research and see, or his coloring, um, and see how he looks. But they're looking. So there was a little fill in on the birds. Um, we've been working crazy in the studio this week. Um, I think this last week we got about 10. Um, custom orders for our livestock signs that we do on we've got those listed on Etsy um, among other things that we've got orders for um, and we've got a show this weekend so <laughs> we will see you on the next video